Hi, my name is Lisa B and I'm the author of the international best-selling book, Banish the Bitch and Bring Out the Babe. People ask me all the time what the book's about. It's about quite a few different things. It's about finding Mr. Right, it's about relationships, it's about dating, it's about when relationships don't go so well anymore. But it's also about masculine and feminine energy. Now my intention is not to offend anybody, so if you don't like the terminology masculine energy, please use the word strength. If you don't like the terminology feminine energy, please use the terminology love. Now I'm just about to give you a sneak peek into what Banish the Bitch and Bring Out the Babe is all about. We all have access to two energies. There is masculine energy and feminine energy. Masculine and feminine energy is not gender-based. A man can be masculine and a man can be feminine. A woman can be feminine and a woman can be masculine. And not everyone uses both energies. Some people stay in the one energy all the time. When we stay in one energy, we can feel dissatisfied and unhappy with our life because we don't get to experience the other side of ourselves. We don't get to feel what a balanced life feels like. Masculine energy is when you're in your head. You are determined to achieve your goals. You will not let anyone or anything get in your way. Your goal is to achieve and conquer. Feminine energy is when you're in your heart, your pure love. You will do more to help others than you probably even do for yourself. Balancing your masculine and feminine energy is everything. Our energy affects everything in us. We need to balance our energy to feel fulfillment so we're not stuck at work. Sometimes we need to step into our power to make things happen. In friendships, understanding the dynamic of your friendship can allow you to have a deeper connection. Intimate relationships. In order to have polarity and passion in a relationship, there needs to be two opposite energies. If you are masculine and so is your partner, there will effectively be two men in your relationship. You probably won't feel polarity or passion. We need to remember to balance our masculine and feminine energy. We need to learn how to flick the switch between the two. Thank you so much for watching and if you'd like to know more about masculine and feminine energy, please go to my website. You can either go to lisab.com.au or banishthebitch.com and you'll find all sorts of different resources there from books to online courses to anything that you want to know about masculine and feminine energy. And please join my podcast on iTunes, The Lisa B Show. Thank you.